Welcome to the trap as we are my back back lit is the out of here out of here. Any man battle rap trap and we definitely got the streets. D out again, D out of here, man. Put it on your you I can't hear you, CD. Say that again, bro. I said it's Avo doing the stream. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, okay. Yeah, because that, that Avo stream be so water. It's just like that's an automatic. Yeah, Avo don't miss. No, nah, I nigga don't miss it all. Like I ain't gonna hold you. Uh, the, the, but those battles today should be lit, though. I think everybody gonna watch them today for sure. Is that what we doing today? No, definitely. Okay, yeah, your background hella loud. Were you at a game or something? Nigga? Yeah, I'm in my son' baseball game. Oh, okay. Tell them keep doing that shit, nephew. You know why? They they get the most money, nigga. I wish, <laughs> you know what 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 I. You know what our parents did wrong, nigga? They always putting us a goddamn basketball or a football in our hand. Like, but I played baseball young, though. I did play baseball young. I didn't know it made that much money, but it, you know what I'm saying? But I played them all. But they always forced basketball and football on the niggas. When we should go pick up a goddamn bat, it's less impact on the body. You do not tear ligaments and stupid shit like that. You don't got to do all that, man. It's like... You think about it. Is a baseball player in shape, y'all? Radio, what's up, my boy? Hey, baseball players don't even got to be in – baseball players don't even got in shape. We had Mark McGuire, man. Mark McGuire, he, he didn't look like he did a sit-up ever, and he was smacking the shit out that ball, nigga, and getting paid for it. I played baseball when I was younger, though, Verb. There was no swag in that shit, man. It ain't no swag. I did, too. My mama forced me to play it. Yeah, my like mom I, did, too. There was no swag. I never I thought it. it was good. I never thought, <laughs> like, it's like baseball was slow-paced. Yeah. It's a slow pace. Like, like, baseball ain't a sport of excitement. But they yeah. get the money, though. Them niggas get ah, they do. You know, you. y'all niggas is wild and saying it ain't no saying you don't gotta be in shape is crazy and saying ain't no swag in baseball is crazy. Okay, but no, bros, do you no gotta be in shape? Pros. Do you gotta be in shape for fun? But you don't gotta be. Physical, you don't have to physical. look like a professional athlete to play baseball. No, no you don't. You still, gotta, you still gotta be in like you still gotta be in strength and conditioning, bro. You, uh, hey, like a bros. strong nigga. Now hold on, real quick, redo. A, a scrawny ass nigga, not just driving the ball three hundred and fifty yards with no type of in shape. Okay, but but what if that ain't his specialty? But what if he can zip that bitch by you, like throwing it like it's a skittle? Man, you don't gotta be. Now look, it, now, it, look now look. That don't mean you can run for a long. Like like when you say in shape, they don't have to be in football, basketball, hockey shape. I agree with you. You can be a fat ass nigga, and if you could throw that bitch ninety six, you win the majors. Mm -hmm. But like how many people? Look. But how many people walking around chucking a baseball around ninety six miles per hour? Shana. That's a fact, but you can play. You can play eighty percent of that game with your hands in your pocket. Shayna, Shayna can do it. Shayna can throw that ball, that motherfucking fast. No, nah, that's crazy, bro. And that, that's crazy. Yeah, no, my bad, bro. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm ready to get on swamp ass. I'm sorry. I'm ready to <laughs> come here. <laughs> come here, nigga. Come here. Hey, swamp. It's gonna feel real dumb when you think you did all that hard right, and then I come in there and take a razor and slit your soft ass up so quick and pour alcohol on you, nigga. Who? Yeah, but but baseball, man, you ain't gotta be it. now a soccer player. They gotta be in maximum shape for sure. But they get the most most money. Yeah, hey, they're bro, in maximum shape. I had to walk away because the game I was over with anyway. But you're right, man. I played baseball young, and I thought it was boring. I had got an athletic scholarship in football in Tuskegee. But the crazy part mm -hmm. about it is, if I kept playing that shit, I'd probably be rich right now. Like, mm. that's the what money position? right there. What position? I played first base. Man, that shit, man. Hey, you know what? If I if I had a son again, like in the future, if I made another son, you playing baseball, bro. I got you you, I got I got twins, bro. I'm not putting them on the football field. They're not mine, I'm though, Charles. No, they're no, not no, mine. I need I, mine. But I tell you what, my boy's going on the baseball field all day. And, or soccer. Get them, man. Keep that fucking basketball out their hand, man. Unless they pick that ball up. Unless you see your son and picking that ball up. <laughs> no, no, no. You can spot a young hooper quick. Like, if no, he no picking question. the ball up. And, and you'll just see the rhythm, how he put it on the floor. If he just got a little rhythm with it, okay, oh, he's he telling you that. The ball, Verb. You can know if he play or not. You can see it. You, you can see how focused he is when he bounces it. You'll be able to tell. But other than that, man, look, baseball, man, it's less impact. And they their careers last longer because they're they not taking impact. 
They don't even got to be quick or nothing. And the thing about baseball, baseball is you can be the average size human and do it. Football and play got to be huge to make it. Hey, hey, TD, I went to hoop with some NBA niggas in LA when I took Will, right? And I was I was doing their drills and shit, no problem. And they all did. Now, this is what they said. Hey, he shoot better than a Pat Beverly, for real. Yeah, I saw Rashad like, posted it. I saw yeah, that. Yeah. He said, he said, no, 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 dude really does. I was doing their drills and shit. You know, I can do their drills, but I can't do them effectively. As, them niggas are machines, man. Like, they, they, it's like a miss to them don't even calculate. It don't even calculate. It's like if they miss a shot, they, it's like they, they really recalculate, okay, this is what I do here. And I won't miss another one. Bro, that shit is unreal, man. It's, it's unreal, bro. Unreal. Man, man, we was doing drills where you had to hit 10 in a row before you even moved, man. Like, for real, to the next spot. It's like seeing it from a pro aspect, it just lets you know how we ain't shit. Us as regular humans, with uh, regular uh, physical ability humans. Like, you know what I'm saying? We, like, physical. Like, Gerald looks at us as, like, toys. Like, he was like, yeah, y'all so little. Like, y'all are nothing. That's the way he views us. Like, y'all are nothing. We can just pick y'all up and break y'all in half. Yo, but dog, I, I played in the flag football game, a charity yo, flag football game. Gerald, Reggie Bush. Gerald, Gerald, different, bro. This nigga, Reggie Bush, he got the ball, nigga. I've never seen somebody move that fast with the ball in my life, nigga. And he's playing flag? Yeah, y'all playing, ain't shit. Playing flag. It was like, like <laughs> he was he running y'all in the ground. Bro, he laughing, <laughs> nigga. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. Crazy. This, the, the mm-hmm. nigga Gerald walked into my studio and I'm like, okay, this is what NFL player looks like. This shit is what? different. Like, 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 if he Super was human. like, me, me and bros was in there together. I'm like, yo, if, 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 if Gerald flip out, it's nothing we can do physically. Like, we couldn't oh, stop it. We it's couldn't n- do bro. nothing. Nigga, I was over his crib and I was like, hey, dog, let me ask you a question. How, how fast could you get to me? And I'm probably about like, 15, 20 yards away. I said, how fast could you get to me if you had to? He said, uh, one step, maybe. 15 like, yards? That's, that's he said, a he said, He said, one or two steps, he's right at me. It ain't nothing I can do about it. I said, that fast? He said, yeah, man, we're trained to go get a nigga anywhere it goes, man. We're trained. Go get him. And when you start seeing it, look at in a, three, body? In, in a three-point stance, like I can, I can get up from the ground and get you. And, and I'm steps. coming to get you. Yeah, you're not doing nothing about it either. Dude said he could tackle me and take me through a wall if he had to. Several. Look, the yeah. crazy <laughs> part about it is we talk about special dudes. Gerald special. I think he going to the hall. And like Rito, he just brought up yeah, Richard sure. Bush. But the, the dude on the bench can go anywhere in America and fade everybody. And won't nobody be able to stop. Not, and they not, don't not, they don't feel pain. Not only that, not only that, T D Gerald wasn't like the biggest D lineman. Like he big mm, as shit. It's more. What? Like Gerald was strong and like super fast and shit. But like you go look at like a Fletcher Cox or like a you know, like these dudes is robots. Vince Wilfork, bro. nigga. Vince yeah, Wilfork, like, big ass. Uh, Lowly Naha, big ass. Like them the niggas are, are Matt Truck. Remember BJ and, and they're moving, and and they moving the like that too. They moving like that. Like, what makes him get picked to be that, though? Like, is it like a lottery or something? It's God, like... God got to pick you, bro. He just got to put you... Yeah, in that's... The, ball, everything bro. Everything went right, bro. You got everything line, just man. went right. Your mom and your pop happened to be a little tall. You know what I'm saying? Your grandpa mm. was six foot seven. You just... Mm. Had, it, that shit, it's a lot to go but, into But, that. Verb, it's genetics. Be. Think about it, Verb. You... you, it's you genetics. In my book, yeah. you the GOAT battle rapper. Like, I mean... That's how I am. Like, it... I'm a kid swamp, too. It, it, it just... It just things... Are oh, you say your mama and your daddy... They they do music. It's, they all, it's they genetic, do, yeah, my my it's yeah, my old dude play everything, do music. He, my old dude still tour right now though, to this day. He still tours with his band right now. And he like 70 and dude still tours. See, that's the thing. It's genetics, man. It's like the breathing. So what happens what happens when like we see Michael Jordan's kids and them niggas ain't got it? What what you think happened there? God bless wow. Mike. God bless Mike so much his kids don't get nothing, bro. It's just what it they is. They don't get like, nothing? You think they don't <laughs> have nothing? Nothing. No, 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 no. <laughs> bro, that's oh, no, crazy, oh, no, dog. Oh, no, like oh, nothing is oh, no. crazy. Bro. Nah, when I say nothing, I was I was saying from like an athletic standpoint. Like God I get everything to your pop. Of course, they got something. They pop is Michael Jordan, but y'all don't get y'all don't get. The, and and they both the bro, that, They both went D one, but like you got to think about it. you got you got to add you got to add uh yeah no did they went D one but like listen Giannis brother wrapping them niggas up right now man Giannis brother will go mm-hmm. to any park in America. <laughs> I'm talking about thirty on both of my kids, bro. They was trash, but they they still play Division one. 
You got to add Juanita's genetics in there. But that, that's because of their pop. Yeah, though, right? I get that. If they didn't D1 go to D1 North D1 Carolina, D1. they didn't go to D1. college. D1. Me and you would have played D1 too if he was our pops. I'd have played, I'd have played it, I'd have played it Alabama up in Tuscaloosa somewhere for sure. No question about Straight it. Straight up, I feel. Yeah, I think because even when you look at Floyd Grandbaby by uh, NBA Youngboy, that little dude is a fighter, man. Yo, I ain't gonna hold you, Verb. Nah, he looked like he's throwing his Verb, hands. Verb, I can't wait for seventeen years from now when I can buy that pay per view. Youngboy gonna be a dog. He gonna he's, it's, gonna it's, he, he's starting too Verb. early. Verb. Look Verb. how he's moving. Verb. He like ah. now Verb. now Verb now Verb. now say say he get boy. say he get Mayweather's hands, but he got Youngboy's aggression. That's gonna be a wild ass little boxer. That's gonna I, be a wild ass little boxer. Well, well, what else he gonna get? I mean, you gotta look. I, I ain't gonna hold you. The young boy had gloves on before he could walk. Yeah, he did. And then, and then, like the the thing that stands out to me too is because I got a lot of kids and shit, and only certain things get certain kids' attention. When he be in the ring with Floyd, when Floyd be training, he don't be he like he don't be occupied by nothing. He be staring dead at his grandpa hitting the mitts, and he and he like. It, it intrigues him. It gets his attention. All he gonna know is boxing, bro. All a young boy gonna know is boxing. Yeah, Floyd said that skipped the generation. It skipped from his kids and went to his grandson. Listen, what, it what, will. What, it what, will skip though. Sometimes things yeah. do skip. It'll skip a whole line, and then the next one will be over powerful. Like so, that. I, I, yeah. I, think, I think he got a son named Karan that actually do train and box. But he even said it on a um on a twenty four seven documentary, like. He don't want to see none of his kids fight. They don't have that dog in them. They was rich. Like, they ain't had to fight for nothing. You know what mm. I mean? You say it take a different type of beast to get in the, the square circle and actually yeah. crumble. And they don't, yeah. they, they ain't come from where he came from. Like, right. like yeah, Roger, that Roger makes and Floyd Mayweather, they was both professional for all three of his, two, both his uncles and his pop was professional fighters, but they wasn't, big, they wasn't high level prize fighters. So Floyd didn't grow up rich. It wasn't like a, his pops was really fighting for for minimum checks like you know what i'm saying it was never really million dollar and they wasn't even paying mid low level guys back then not to disrespect roger or floyd senior because they both were sharp but um yeah nah you gotta be you gotta you gotta be handpicked bro you gotta handpick you e what's up man what you got up over there man <sighs> nigga no i'm in the lab man in the you lab. know it's swinging them hey hey you know i i woke up tripping Nigga, that nigga Swamp gonna post. He a dead bitch. Nigga, I picked up another knife and said, nigga. <laughs> man, man, you little y'all stupid fuck, nigga. Y'all wasn't in the dojo. I was up 7.30 in the dojo. Y'all wasn't. Uh, my shit nigga, no, no, I was. Hey, yeah, I, 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 oh, I, I hey, left hey, the hey, dojo hey, last night, bro, at 2 a.m. So I, hey, I, 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 I was chilling. I'm two a day right now, though, eh? I'm two okay. a day. I'm not okay. working hard. Okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. I'm not working hard. You, you, all you doing is keeping the line, and that's it, huh? You ain't working hard yeah. right now. Yo, listen. I'm I'm so finished my training today. Tiger Woods tee off for the Masters at twelve forty five. Break kick my feet up. Ice ice the knuckles down and relax, bro. Oh, okay. Okay. Cause, and you got a couple weeks to ice them down, huh? It ain't nothing. Just ice them down. I'm right back in it tomorrow. Uh, but hey, hey, you know what? My my dojo don't close, so I just go in there whenever the fuck I feel like it. Mm. Two thirty, five thirty, yeah. seven thirty. <laughs> oh, like, yeah, I got one at the crib. Like, I, all I do is change the lights and you know pick up some nunchucks and shit and get the yeah. What's up? And then when I see a nigga like Swamp say some threatening shit, I just open the door again. That's it. What he I, he gonna bet something in? Weird ass nigga. What you mean? I'm putting you in a blender, man. And you will not look the same the next day. I promise you, you will not look the same. And you, you're going to look real faulty. I promise you the next day. Nobody believes your words because you lie all the goddamn time. You're going to look very faulty that next day, though. For sure. For sure. It's a couple. I know, I know Charlie battled this weekend, so I'm going to be, you know, I'm going to see. I'm going to see. I'm going to yeah, see. Yeah, we on the same card up there in Cleveland on Friday. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. uh, okay, okay. Yeah, so, bro, just, let, just text me what, like, like, threat level. Ten highest. I mean, he gonna be oh, okay. he, he gonna he gonna oh, be a five. On. He gonna oh, be a five. Okay. You want after after I cook down up, you want me to put the scouting hat on? Just you know, yeah, just, yeah. Just, yeah. Just, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you want me to put the scouting hat on? I got you. I got you. I hey, 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 guys, save your time. I know how this gonna go. Uh, uh-uh. uh, he gonna be powered up for E. Dumb. Uh, uh, who E taking? Uh, Fonz. Fonz in the one round, draw. He gonna oh, be it's only a one round champion. Yeah, it's only one round. Oh, it's only one round. That's a walk through for Charlie. Respect. Right. Yeah, it ain't, it ain't nothing. No disrespect yeah, to Fonz. It can be anybody, but one round is they just. Fonz gonna try to smoke him though. Yeah, no, Fonz gonna Fonz gonna go go at him, but just yeah, Charlie, just like 
verb. It's like a little club walk through, a little hour walk through the joint. Yeah, yeah. Charlie Clips in the building. Oh, mm-hmm. checking them Cliff, out. Clips can know. probably do the one round on the plane for real. Mm-hmm. On the plane. Hey froze, oh, hey froze. That nigga hey, will write that shit as soon as he land. Right. Yeah, I was in the froze. I was in the. I building watched him do it. Sure. Yeah, I bro- froze. I was in the building for sugar, and I w- I seen this nigga in the back, and he was throwing that whole sugar together in the back. Hold on, hold on. Redo. No, 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 no. Y'all, y'all not, y'all not, y'all not giving Charlie enough credit, nigga. Our battle. I saw him put our thir- put his third round together in the parking lot by the taco stand. He would do that, man. <laughs> like, <laughs> that nigga would do that, bro. He <laughs> different, bro. Hey, hey, hey. He ain't talking about on the plane. Charlie do that shit outside. That nigga Chuck, man, man, we, we man, we pulled up in LA one time. That nigga had a round and a half, man. No bullshit. And then the next day, he had enough to fight. And I was like, this is wild, man. This I couldn't even get on a plane knowing I got a round and a half. I, my anxiety. Yeah, I, can't, I can't do that. I can't do I can't that. Do it. I got when I battle Jack. That's not a funny joke I'm to me. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I don't. I get my anxiety. Yeah, it's kind of wild how how, he, how he's able to do that. You know what I'm saying? Dude plane. can do anything, man, for real. I, I got like, that's a gift. Up. DNA can do it, too, though. He can do that. I, I'd be too scared to get on the plane. I'm not though. sure. I'm, I'm not sure if Verb... Okay, all right, all right. Verb, I got on What's a up? flight okay, sure what? Jag, and I only, I only knew What's my What's up? You can hear me or something? Yo, y'all can hear me? No, I don't, think, I don't think Froze can hear you, Verb. For or real? you can't hear Froze, because he was talking the whole time. Oh, well, bring him back in. Bring him back in. You got the you got the pistol. Everybody in the train. Everybody is at work right now. Froze is training. E training. Verb training. Swamp. Oh, right, I already Dr. know. Seuss. I got a feeling. Okay. I got. I see. I see the little. I see the little hits. Them niggas trying to do. Everybody uh-huh. are good. Good throwing out blows. Oh, uh, uh, when I see DNA blog, I said, Oh, oh they trying to lie okay. me. I said they, they trying coming to for lie your head. Me. They yeah, coming I for your that. head. I said, All right, yeah. I got it. I got it. I gotta hop back into the dojo. Stop playing with them. Yeah, they they they, they, they come. Oh, oh, they coming. They definitely coming. Like, but I think I, I think I, I think the Chrome weekend, trenches weekend, because of the people that's out, is making everybody be on their a game. That's only like like when certain people come out, everybody get razor sharp though. It right. is when you see dog fights and shit when it matter, everybody wants to come in. Like even Swamp Little Talent, he wants to be the best version of what he want to be. You know what I'm saying? I, I respect that. And no, I know he. You ain't the fuck lying. As soon as I seen Coffee Brown was on the card, I said, "No, no, I ain't about to stink in front of Coffee." And that shit don't even mean nothing, bro. Yeah, it's, it's not. It, it's it's just sometimes some. It's just when the energy real, you just want to be your best version of yourself. You know what I'm saying? Or, or whoever. The only thing we can do is be the best version of ourselves at that moment. That's it. So we just train hard for that. That's it. And, and then you got a lot of B-side tricks. Like, in E case, okay, and when Charlie started landing, it's going to be overwhelming because we ain't expecting him to. When Swamp started landing, it's going to be overwhelming because you're not expecting him to. So that means the A-side nigga got to really shred you the fuck up. Hey, Swamp, and I don't got no problem shredding you the fuck up, nigga. No problem, nigga. You going to learn. All y'all learn, don't you? Niggas think they got the greatest shit in the world until I start. Then you gotta, then you gotta measure that stupid shit, don't you? Then you gotta say, oh, hold on, I ain't him, nigga. You ain't him. You ain't never been him, nigga. You ain't gonna just be him that quick, nigga. You can't just decide one day that you, oh, you know what? I'm gonna be Kobe Bryant, nigga. You can't fucking decide that. You had to been Kobe the whole time. Fuck is you talking about? You don't got the genetic, nigga. Stupid fucking nigga. Hey man, this nigga triggers me. I ain't gonna hold y'all, bro. Like for real, this one triggers me though. And, and and I think it's your fault too. It's for sure your fault. It's I should have took anybody. I should have took yeah. anybody else and got the same money. And it's like this one. It's like 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 for real. Like that, now that we hear it, it's like I could have took anybody. Bro. It's like look, like look, I know he, I know he triggered verb E because because Swamp don't got to say much to piss verb off. Like Swamp, yeah, it, it's gonna hold you, man. That that bad boy's four look like a fire movie. Man, your corny ass don't even watch no bad boys. Yo, you can't like judge no it. movie, pussy. <laughs> don't you, you not judge. never try to judge no fucking movie when I'm out here, nigga? It's like that because it's like it, this one. Hey, E, for real, this one triggers me, man. It's making me very violent, man. Because it's like, hey, bro, you you really think you a? It's like it's like seeing Pinocchio like trying to shop in Macy's for shirts, knowing he ain't no real boy. You know what I'm saying? It's like, hey, man, what the fuck is you doing, Pinocchio, if you don't go take that shit off of G.I. Joe? Like, who the fuck you supposed to be? 
it's like seeing seeing Pinocchio in, in in Macy's buying polo shirts and hats and shit. You like the fuck you need that for? You know, hey, bro, let boy. me ask you something about our frozen ad. It does it matter who wins? Uh, I think for Frozen Ave, the thing with Frozen Ave, if they both do what they supposed to do, everybody going to be happy because, I mean, we know that we know what we're trying to, we know what they both are able to do. Like, sometimes, some fights, both niggas just got to be good, man. Like, for real, right. both niggas really got to be good. I think Frozen Ave, they both are going to be good, though. I don't think, I don't think either party is going to run from anything. I don't think so. I think they both gonna stand up to the challenge because they kind of don't have a choice in this situation. You like you hundred percent don't have a choice. I don't think none of us really have a choice but to really fight this weekend that weekend for real. It's gonna be beautiful women out, the water is clean. Right. And you know what I'm saying? I mean Shayna there, so you really gotta be like, you know what I'm saying? A little more cleanly. Hey you know Fro, hey yo Fro, now you I'm, know Ab try to go in there. And- Cookie, you know that got, he definitely got, is. Got, he definitely I've, said I've, that. I've got nine rounds to complete in two weeks, and I'm I'm the middle battle that he has. Like I'm not gonna lie to you, unless you, Danny, of that cloth, we never really seen him do something like that. Um, right. yeah. I, I, he's a human. He's not. He's not a superhero. Um, his his qual his material is going to take a quality hit. At what capacity, I don't know. But it, it definitely is. The, it definitely the fact, I, I agree. The fact that he would take a matchup like me in that with that scenario, like I, I don't know. I, well, 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 look at it like this, Froze. If I'm Av, because Av is a skilled writer, if he's taking Don Marino right before you, that's what he's taking before you, right? Mm-hmm. He gonna play around. The lights is on here. He's gonna be. He gonna. He gonna. He bringing you the the smoke because nah, the I, lights I are off. Disagree, but then he gotta fly to Chicago and go see Tuna in his backyard. Now nah, I know niggas be down on Tuna, but at the same time, for me. Schedule is everything, and um, you know. I, but I, froze, you the target though, bro. You're the yeah, target, so that, that, you, yeah. you 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 getting the hardest shit regardless. Yeah, that, that's, it's like that's you, the yeah, one he can't right. lose. No, no, that, you're the one yeah. he can't lose, so, bro. So, yeah, but that on paper, that's what we what we assume because that's the right thing to assume. Like, ah, oh, you look at these three matchups. Ah, uh, he can't fuck around with froze, so he not gonna fuck around. Well, we can't project what Ab gonna do. I think what we should be saying is he better not slack on the Froze battle. Not losing not. losing to you on that weekend will hurt, Froze. Yeah, that's what I was hurt. just asking you, Vert. I that said who hurt. who yeah. who can't lose that battle. I don't know. So I let's say well, 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 but he can fight though. E he right. can look look if Av come in and be Av, and he's a he's a he's a potent Av, and, and even if Froze edge him or he or in reverse, we still good with that. It ain't no you know what I'm saying. But he's gonna come tripping with Froze because. All the lights are on. This shit is gonna be on yeah. live pay per view stream. Yeah. It's no ducking it. Ain't no app numbers. Ain't nothing. Everything is right then right and there. Here. That's what, yeah. Y'all kind of yeah. got the pressure because it's clips. A, they not trusting clips right now, so they got they got. Sure is. And it's on y'all, bro. Well, nah, well, it's a it's a it's a swing or get swung on battle. I mean, it's right. it's about it. Um, but but again, hey froze. I'm gonna take you too. Somebody asked me about you and shit too. That's a good bet. The odds are gonna be good on froze up in Vegas on DraftKings. You know, I'm gonna get a bet. No, 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 not versus me though. Well, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see yeah, we'll see these nuts. <laughs> you ain't no odds of betting hey, take away from you. Fuck with me. I've been triggered. Hey, I'm tripping ain't I, bro? Hey, help me, bro. <laughs> help me. Hey, help bro. Me. Hey, man, he didn't I even have... mean that, bro. That man tripping, I dog. Did, I ain't even mean to, bro. It's like, <laughs> bro, I don't have two demons on me. Swamp got him more it... angles right now. He's just shooting at anybody. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, you know, hey, bro. Me tripping, and bro, we can... <laughs> hey, bro. I... Hey, yo, for everybody that's in here, if y'all ain't get y'all tickets or getting y'all tickets, y'all can go on either site, www.guttercity.com or the Eventbrite slash Pro 23. You can buy tickets for both events. If you buy both tickets for both events, you do get a discounted rate on VIP and general admission and stage passes. We're with the easy and VZ is going to be physical tickets, though. You know I mean, that's not going to count towards the, you know what I mean, because y'all got to pay for that. But you know what I'm saying? We'll be physical tickets at the easy, yeah, at the easy and VZ, John. We only really inviting probably like 40 people out to, to that. And, and y'all already know, man. But grab y'all tickets because the tickets is selling. Thirty girls too. Thirty girls, ten of the, the other kind. We don't even need y'all because y'all hey, froze. Like we just hey, need hey, froze. I want to. I want to say this. I've been seeing a lot of people say, "Well, I'm gonna kill froze." Let me tell y'all something, man. Frozenberg, he don't get the respect he deserves in this game, in my opinion. And he's a fighter, just like Gerald said the other day. Y'all think Abs is gonna come here and breeze through froze? I don't know why y'all don't respect him. Froze is gonna do his thing. 
for real. T T D, your, your knowledge of battle rap is very high because you're not easily, you know, persuaded by the masses. Anybody who really know the sport, who don't give a fuck who they like more out of me and Ab, notice a coin flip battle. But, but for real, for real, knowing that as the battler is an advantage, honestly. I can sit up here and tell you, yo, listen, I'm a sm- this is a coin flip battle, but I'm aware of that, which means I'm preparing dangerous. He's got nine rounds in two weeks. I haven't battled in seven months. Think about who you're betting your money on, and then think about what I've done. So, you know, for me, you know, this, this is just no, another one of those opportunities to go up there, do what I know I'm going to do, and then I'll be able to get back on spaces and shit like this and point at niggas. Like, what was you saying? I was going to do what? We'll see. I ain't been as comfortable in a long time. Yeah. Be... The corner going to be mad and ain't mind. Like, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, like, <laughs> I don't think they know I'm going to bring the fight to Av. You know what I'm saying? Are uh, you coming yeah, forward, bro? You I'm coming forward? Fight. Like, he can't just fight to defend himself. If he ain't going in there with no offense... And he's just trying to skate by because it's, I'm telling you, I'm bringing a fight to you. Elbows in a clinch, all types of dirty shit, bro. You shitting me? Every time the ref break us up, I'm going to punch him. Uh, every time. Every time you, you know, they get locked because we both left handed. We both mm-hmm. left handed. So, right. left-handed. so I like both, you. And you know so what, bro? I like it because. Look, look, look. We both left handed, bro. So mm-hmm. we both vulnerable to the head, but, you know, both left handed fighters, you know, the head, but is that. I'm elbows in the clinch, all that shit. Oh, so, so, so are you saying this is a fro that's coming, uh, that he's tripping? I'm saying protect yourself at all time, man. Damn. <laughs> Damn. That's, that's fine. Protect, protect yourself protect at all time, time ass. That's how you felt like talking and, to that and, nigga? And, and, listen, here's, the, here's the, the greatest thing about that weekend is nobody's from there. So we can't say nobody no, lying. Like we can't say nobody got hooked. Well, Dime well I mean, but Don, yeah, but we, but Don Friday sipping pina coladas and shit like he, he's from Miami, <laughs> big Miami shit. Is Don gonna give you a problem, bro? Uh, Don, Don gonna get me ready for the fight fast. Damn, but what if Don come in there tripping and clip your ass? Well, he's, he's gonna come in there tripping, clipping me a different conversation. They two different conversations. Oh, my bad, Froze. Oh, no, wait perfect. a minute. Hey, hey, Froze, when you load it, man, this sound kind of scary, man. I'm just saying, like, clipping me and, and, and yeah, nah, he tripped on you real quick, bro. Yeah, he, yeah, yeah, like, bro, dude, bro. Wants, like, man, Froze, like, yeah, whatever you're trying to get into, nigga. I'm like, hold on, whoa, 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 whoa. That's like, it's like, it's, it's like, it's, it's like the little brother that got his first big gun, and he like, you ain't talking to me like that no more. It's like, whoa, <laughs> maybe I'm not. <laughs> maybe I'm not. Hey, if you do not have your ticket, you might want to get it. Trust me, they it's almost over with. Ain't nobody coming to see Swamp. Ain't nobody coming to see Shana. That's documented. All right, so get you what you can. The Easy and VZ show is exclusive. We're doing an exclusive podcast. We're going to have very important people coming so you filthy niggas can't come. All right? Niggas. Niggas ain't swamp. Talking about some swamp fans coming to see him. Boy, he ain't got, they don't got that type of money. Fuck no. Nah. Swamp fan got the type of money to come to, to Miami on Cinco de Mayo? Man, a swamp fan can get the money to come to Miami when Southwest got a special. But not no motherfucking no. Nah, you know how high that shit is. Come on, man. People are fans of who, uh, like, a fan becomes. They like who they can look at and say, "Okay, he's like me, right?" Okay, Swamp fan. Swamp does not. He's not a flashy fan that looks successful or no shit like that. So why would people come to see that nigga and spend their money? Like, I mean, what are y'all talking? Ain't nobody buying Shana's fuck you talking about who's spending their money to go see Shayna? matter of fact who's spending their money to see any of you hoes i mean well except zan i like zan now zan's my buddy tag zan hey e, i like zan zan's good with me zan's okay. good with me it's the trenches, it's the trenches. trenches. Yeah, zan's, zan's good with me but ain't nobody here to watch you hoes they're here to watch me baby how, how does this not make sense swamp ain't bigger than bird why would he bring more people Verb, you think um you don't you think Shayna and Prestavia good matchup? Oh, I, oh, I'm on Prestavia team for that one. Say that. No, actually, to be real, which is a great matchup though. Like, hey, Shayna, this one I take take the collar off of you for a second and let you be a human. 
Actually, Shane and Prestavia, I don't know who picked that, but that was a good idea, though. It was a good idea because, like, we seen Prestavia on a return, and I am a big – when I saw – I thought Prestavia – I was kind of biased to Prestavia at first because surf like that. I was like, fuck that bitch, right? That's how I was at first, right? When I saw her at, at, at Holla shit up close, I told her, I put my arm around her, I said, you're special. That little girl is special, man. Like, I looked at her in her face, bro. And I was listening to her. I said, hey, this girl will be a problem for 99.9% .9 of y'all. Surf scouted her right. For sure. She's unique. She has a pit bull attack. She's, she's witty. She's lyric driven. She don't make mistakes. Her approach is beautiful. Like, man, that now here's the thing. Shayna, is Shayna more active than Prestavia or is it about the same? Because when last time we saw Shayna? Was you, Fro? Was that the last time we saw Shayna with Froze? Yeah, I think that might have been. I, I think so. Last, yeah. About yeah. a year. Okay, the last time we saw Prestavia was about a year ago. Maybe. I'm so, so yeah, because bags and bodies, yeah. So, I mean, when you're talking about them, because one thing people don't know, if you stay away from this stage too long, you will get rusty as a motherfucker. Because the world, it changes. The temperature of the world changes. Like, you got to stay kind of. Hey, Verso, you don't think that since Prestavia ain't battling about a year, you don't think it's going to be like she got a, that first round going to uh -uh. be like a little. She's too man? skilled, bro. Uh -uh. No? She's too skilled. Like, when okay. you listen to what she's able to do with a pen, she, like, when you can, when you have the ability to write at a high clip, you ain't really worried about nothing. Like, I wouldn't care nothing about what Swamp is able to do with why would I care? Because it's like, I know what I'm capable of doing. So his power means nothing to me, like zero. So, but that girl writes so good. See, what, what confidence comes in is the writer part of it. If you know you've put together some cold shit, you're eager to say it back. You see what I'm saying? But if you don't have that ability in these fights here, you got to be like that the whole time, though. The moment you take a break, it could cost you anything. It's, it could cause because you could start off out the gate hot, but if you don't stay out the gate hot and your opponent stays hot, that she you wasted your time. This one of them type of things, and, and actually this weekend gonna be so brilliant because it's so. Hey y'all, listen, I'm telling y'all, if you got money, of course you do. If I'm on the call and you like me, right? If you if you got a couple dollars to spare, it will be more than worth it. You will make all your, especially with bloggers. Bloggers, this is the time. When y'all come out there and do the right thing. Hey, look, I'm trying to get next to him. How can I pay to do it? You'll make your money crazy that weekend because everybody will be out. Y'all don't know. The stars are coming out to watch. Y'all don't know that yet. Y'all will be, as soon as this shit start this weekend, that Chrome Trenches weekend, y'all going to be saying, I should have been down there. You're going to start seeing too much, for sure. For sure. Because we know what time it is. Like, other people don't know, but this this weekend was a weekend not to miss for at all at all it's it's gonna be beautiful cinco de mayo the food the vibe the after parties the before parties the real girls all that type of shit you might want to be there you might definitely what like when when this was presented to me i i i had to say yeah hey hey he he'll tell you i gave i didn't give no pushback like that i had to i was like yeah let's do that for sure yeah no absolutely again i say this i appreciate you for sure you dig what I'm saying? Like, you know, made sure and, 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 and did I try to text? Okay, no, now, didn't. Swamp, I want you to hear that, you little weird-ass fuck. I'm going to show you again. Beasley told your ass a lie and you believe. That's why you going to die up there in front of me because this karma, nigga. I didn't text easy for this fight. I didn't try to text Beasley for the fight, nigga. Check this. Look, I told this little stupid nigga. This is why I'm going to fuck you up, man, because you playing with me, man. Look, one thing I do in my life, nigga, don't lie on me, bro. If I did that shit, I did that shit, and I stand on it, and I, there ain't nothing you can do about it. And people that know me, that's why y'all always lose, like, y'all can't hurt me, because y'all try to tell me who I am, and my people tell you otherwise. That ain't accurate on dude, right? I told Beasley the same price, E, that I got for you. That's exactly what I told him, man. Because I knew I didn't feel I, I didn't feel like um I didn't feel like going
Hey, I, I didn't feel like did you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you now. Oh, yeah, 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 I, no, I said yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't feel like debating. I ain't feel like no nah, man, let's just get to it, bro. I, I didn't do all that. I said the same price. The same price, bro. And he lied to you, man. And told you I said something else, man. You believe the nigga, man. And this shit got me so hot. That's why I'm a step on your weird ass, right? Because you believe this nigga. I told you, don't ever trust them fucking East Coast niggas, man. They'll tell you anything, bro. They'll tell you anything. And, and, and you spit on my name, Swamp. You did. You you put a tag on me because Beasley put a tag on me because he couldn't face the fact he did wrong, man. Anytime Beasley been wrong, he run away. Anytime, man. He couldn't face the fact. So he just lied to you. And then you start telling motherfuckers what I said to this nigga and you wasn't even there. I, hey, hey, Swamp, I didn't tax easy at all. You know, you know how much money I can probably get for you? I said, yeah. Like I said, yeah, every other time. I ain't look, people that in this culture, they know I ain't hard to book. If you got the money, I don't go when okay, this is where a lot of rappers, I want y'all to listen and pay attention. You never in this game try to shoot for a wild number consistently. The best thing to do is get the money that you need plus a little more all the time. That is the secret to this. So if it's something you got to do, right? If you say, okay, uh, my girl birthday finna come up. I want to buy her a, a, a Camaro or some shit like that. So then you looking, okay, I got to go grab this $18,000 right quick. Something like that. You think like that. And you will keep getting paid from it and you'll never have to work from it. You'll never have to think from it if you get what you need plus a little more. The moment you outprice yourself, you slowing down your money. And when you think about it, these thoughts you get in your head are going to come consistently anyway. You might as well get paid for it. That's, that's the theory I took and that's why I stayed here in this spot the entire time. All the game I gave easy has worked. Because you got to, this is not just a rapping game. This is where most people, it's so many things that go into play when you get on stage that have nothing to do with your rapping ability. Fan base, momentum, tempo, everything, all that shit matters. Like, y'all don't understand. Pay attention, right? This is a, a veteran move. <clears throat> when Surf took Cortez, right, Surf was powerful before he opened his mouth. He was powerful before he opened his mouth. How? Because he did the outside work. We know outside work. Y'all don't know outside work. You think it's about you just showing up here and doing this. It will not get you paid. And you will constantly lose your gear. Hey, listen. This is the truth. During my battle time since 2009, I kept multiple bitches a mile away from each other. And they all knew it. How was that possible? Got to stay constant. Y'all niggas will think that your talent will hold you. You're going to lose everything around you, bro. Because talent, it's a talented nigga that comes out every day. That's why you got to add in the other flavors to make yourself so rare that you can't be denied. I can be booked. I Look, bro, I got called for three battles two days ago. Like, it's all on me. I reject battles constantly all the time. I reject even promoting some people's cards just because I don't like a nigga you got on the card because he said something smart to me before. I'm that kind of petty nigga. But you got to learn to use every tool around you as a weapon to be stronger. That will keep you here because if you can stand on your own, nobody will stop you. Who stopped me my entire time? You think that I wasn't a prime nigga to stop? Yes. One thing I told Beasley, documented too. I said, hey, Beasley, when a person got the power I got, you supposed to pull him very, very close to you because he knows too much, and he's a weapon of mass destruction. I told him that. I said, Beasley, the way you do surf and you pull him close, what happens when something go wrong? You have to have other stones on the floor, man. You got to plant seeds. You if, you if you plant palm trees, you don't plant one. You plant four of them motherfuckers. Because you, you can't gamble on the nigga. Whoever you put your stock into, right, he has to be level-headed. That's the first thing. That would be me diplomatic, right? Authentic to who he is. Ain't no smut on him. That's the power that you use to control the game. Like, for real. Here's This, this is even worse, all right? One league right now can, can control the entire culture by paying off about four to five niggas. One, whoever wanted to control battle rap to its fullest, all they got to do is pay 
four to five niggas in this game. You pay them four to five niggas who have power of influence, who show up and do their work regardless. Those, you control the entire market. You do not pass the money to your friends. They're not going to stand with you when it's time. Because guess what? Hey, Smack, this is why I talk the shit I talk. Because I'm the only nigga on, in URL history that said one day, I said, hey, look, y'all, why don't we just do a free battle for Smack so we can get the money up higher and we ain't got to do this no more. The rapper stood against me. And guess what? That's documented, too. And I'm a St. Louis nigga because I see the boy. That's why when niggas tell me they used to hustle and shit, I don't believe it. That's why when I tell y'all I hustle, nobody, nobody challenges it in, in any aspect because you got to think further. I'm thinking further down the road. Right. OK. I said, hey, look, and this is on camera, y'all. I said, I said, let's do a free battle for Smack. And I'm a St. Louis nigga because I saw the board. I'm looking. OK, cool. If we do a free night right here, they can't tell us they don't got the money no more. You can't tell us. That means what we need is there. That means we have a bank. That's what that was my thoughts. We have a bank because we did this credit with y'all. You see what I'm saying? OK, if, if 12 of us walk on stage and do a free battle, the, the battle should generate almost a million close to it. You know what I'm saying? Because you got no overhead, right? OK, so I know that in the bank, this is here. This is for all our problems. This for if he get locked up. This for a hey, hey, on, on Christmas and everybody 5,000. That's the way I'm thinking to prolong the culture. All you got to do, it takes one nigga. He pay four niggas. He controls battle rap fully right now. Like I'm talking about because everybody's going to follow the four niggas. Everybody will. You don't pay the niggas with no voices. You pay the niggas with the voices because the niggas with the voices control shit. You, you can't stop them. OK, like a, let's take a person like easy. Right. You pay easy off. Number one, he wasn't stopped. Number one, he defied. The, he, he defied all gravity, shows up, does what he does, draws attention, pay him off. You pay off a verb. It's obvious because I control everything. I can make a fight happen. I can stop a fight from happening. I can I can wake up and control my own machine and I'm going to show up and I'm going to act crazy and I'm known outside of it and the stars stamp it. And this is all the shit that's like you. You pay that off, man. And then you pay off two more. You pay off a hit, man. You pay them niggas off. The game is yours. It won't even take money no more. The game is yours. You pay off four niggas. I say five at max. Five at max. You pay five niggas. Man, please. Ain't, somebody will control battle raps every dollar. Every dollar. It, it, Cause look, now you got all the you you got the veterans following you. You got the the up and comers. You got the females. You got everything. You, battle rap cannot be ran by people that do not rap. It has to be ran by the rappers, man. So one person needs to pay off four to five people. They control the whole culture, right? I'm giving y'all the game, but you let them five niggas dictate the tempo, get the matches determine the pay on it and the culture wins because we know what we're doing when when companies come in and they try to say okay this is what we're going to do you lose you don't last long nobody has ever paid off their 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 god level attractions and set them down and say okay control this here's the budget all of us call niggas and we explain why we doing it the price comes down also, they will get treated better because we're the artists and we know how they want to be treated. Also, we know when to book them because we're looking at the temperature of the tweets when a nigga needs some money. Oh, but that might be a little too much game that I'm giving y'all, right? These things. You know, that, that last one was a little too much game. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm I mean fuck too, them niggas. Let them, let them be where they are. Because I got tons of loans out through Battle Rap. So it ain't no, yeah, let them be where they are. Fact of the matter is this whole this whole culture is controlled if you pay five niggas. And you control it a year straight. Because we will pick the fights. We know what battles to go get. Y'all don't. Y'all don't. And, we, and, and, if, and if all of us is paid off to do it, we're definitely going to want to be successful. Like, it's look, y'all probably should think about that before the rappers form that. Because if we formed our own pyramid, nobody get no money. It don't matter who you are. Why? We don't have to shop with the Swamps and the Chef Trez, niggas. We'll just get more. Brand new fresh ones. Then we bringing in a, a we bringing in 50 new guys because all of us got different eyes. And we're matching that up. We don't need you. You do know that it just takes down, 
if if me, E, Hitman, and two more sat down and did that shit, we wouldn't need y'all for nothing. And we control the culture. So then all the wiggle finger shit don't matter no more. You know that, right? A lot of y'all go home, right? A lot of y'all that done pissed me off, you know, damn sure you ain't getting on no stage. So you fill out an application, pussy. You know Hitman Petty, he ain't letting shit go. He ain't letting shit go. So most of y'all, we would eliminate we would eliminate 25% of the culture off the jump, off people we don't like personally. So now we got a better, cleaner floor, 75% out here. Let's, now let's work. And we know who to pick. We Y'all don't understand. The reason we're here is because of the, the league I created, World War, and I brought Marcus and, I'm sorry, me and Marcus started together and I brought Street Status on. And those were my designs, my ideas. Got us here. So when you sit down and you put together four departments of that shit, there is no more who's in the way. We don't want any product that somebody's already used. We setting up championship fight. Okay, think about it. Midnight Madness was created by me and Surf on the phone, man. We was going to do something together for the culture, to, you know, because it brings in both sides. They just stole it from me, didn't you, Beasley? Did I complain? No. Mm-mm. No, I ain't complaining. But we know what we're doing. That concept was brought together by us. But we know what we're doing, though. That's why when the rappers do it, it's a little more successful because they kind of know. The niggas with money just need to be the niggas with money and just act, and just pick up your money from your investment. You let the battle rappers run it. Because we know what it should feel like. We know what it should look like. We know who needs to be there. We know this bitch don't need to be on stage. We know that nigga don't need to be on stage. Like, we know this. But y'all better hope that shit don't happen. You better hope it. Because them five, the right five niggas sit down, y'all done. Take that as a warning. Take that as a warning. Then you ain't fighting over no rappers because now we don't need your rappers. Because it's clearly proven, right? The culture goes where the good rappers are. It doesn't go to the stage. It's proven now. So if all the good rappers of power sat down and said, we're going to start a new world and do it the correct way, right? Y'all all done. Like y'all are a hundred percent done. Like I think that that's where we at with it, right? Because now we don't have to shop with anybody, because we can go find the new guy and literally put him on stage, and we think he hot. And all of us standing there. So now in the camera, you got me, E, Hitman, and whichever two other niggas with that kind of power standing together. They don't need you, dummy. All the rappers had to do was sit down and just understand how much money it is. Once we can understand how much money we can, well, why would we talk to y'all? We just go get it done. We don't need you. Now Now we're creating new markets because now new markets are opening up all over the world because we got a nigga from Des Moines, Iowa, who popping and his, his cousins and them niggas hard. Now we sliding them in the mix because we know what's really good and what's not really good. Y'all, the, the, the people that companies pick have failed consistently. Like, come on, let's really call a spade a spade. The people that URL pick have failed. 85% of them failed. Hey, you there, hey? Uh, are you yeah, yeah, just yeah, soaking yeah. up the real shit? No, no, it, me too, me too. He, he talking about, yeah, that sounds like a fire plan. I'm trying to be with it. I'm just waiting for him to say Fro's name in some capacity. I ain't hear my Oh, oh no, 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 Fro, let me tell you, let me tell you, Fro. No, no, Fro, that's a, no, 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 Fro, when we say that, we talking about the pyramid, you you already rare, so you go in the pyramid somewhere. We you don't gotta tell you that because he's doing something rare already. It's already doing something that's like if you're doing something rare that's generating and people drawn to it, man, you ain't gotta say nothing. He's in the pyramid somewhere. What floor of the pyramid he on don't matter. He work here. Cause it makes sense. You see, now he he has access. Now, froze, you gotta think. When we all align our our power and our um our connections. Now your stream getting all different type of motherfuckers. And we all making money. Hey, send dude down there, let him do fraud shit. Bam, that's it. Yeah, yeah like, that's what I'm talking about, bro. I'm yeah, like, like, to get to that yeah like, 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 like that type of shit is like, man, I had Lloyd Banks in here the other day, man. Lloyd Banks don't do interviews, man. 
Lloyd Banks sat in here for an hour, man. Like we've been, I, 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 we've been trying to get Lloyd Banks on the show. Nobody sure. gets Lloyd Banks, we've, man. We've been here. trying to get. I'm just telling you, I, I, I shot at him. I'm just telling you, like three, yeah, like, like weeks ago. He does not do interviews. Go find the last Lloyd Banks interview. He came here and kicked it with Vern for an hour, man. We all tied to certain powers, man. You bring all that now. Battle rap is a whole nother company. It, 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 it and all it takes is a, a, a little advance money for the, us to sit down and get it done. And we can couple, throw the couple of hours. Yeah, look, and then look, we throw the events because guess what? We got the 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 promote. What, what do we need them for? Because look, I got the we got the promotion down packet. We all come and throw a press conference on the next ten niggas that we think is cold. Guess what happens? That's just what they are, because the Brandon says so. You if you got me, E, Hitman, and two more of 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 that type of power that draw, and we sitting there saying that these ten niggas is hot. They are. Hit me, you, hit me, surf, and fucking who else you want to put? No, no, nah, I'm off the table. Me. Surf there, I can't. No, I'm no, talking about. Me. I'm talking about. That's it for me. No, 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 that's it for me. That's it for me. What I'm talking, yo, but verb. What I'm talking about is this though. What I'm talking about. I'm talking about as far as star power. Let's say if niggas all really was just like what it was. You just have those four. Somebody else. That should really be like. That's what I. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, but 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 I was just playing by surf because I can work with surfers his money. But when we talking about when we talking about he has to be like a draw that people like. Okay, like when you say. Uh, they got to they have to draw something because a, a, a draw is how we gonna generate the money. You're drawing something to you, so we don't need no niggas who just hot and rap good. We need draws. Who's a fucking draw that they draw to when they see him? They people come to him. Like Gerald came in with me in Chicago, and he said he never seen the room shift like that. I walked in in Chicago. Gerald was with me. The room just did a complete diagonal and drew to me. It, you gotta have that type of power, man. Like people think it's about anything else. Okay, the three I just named for sure, they're draws like that. Okay, so they're going to pull you here. That's all that matters if we can get your attention. That's it. I got a question. Oh, also, hey, how y'all doing? What's up? What's good, babe? Hey, Easy. Let me see. Froze, TD, Rito. What's good with y'all? Hey, bro. I just want to say hi to everybody. Whatever. All right, I got a question. All right, you know how you just said you got to have something that just draws people in? What do you think that female battle rappers need to have that star power besides the fact that they tied to these niggas? What okay, I got I got an answer for you though. For real. It's the it's the the girl the girl's problem is very simple and I keep saying it. It ain't got nothing to do with them fucking I'm I'm off that right now. What the girl's problem is is nobody has figured out how to deliver it uniquely, not like a man. That is the first problem with that. Like y'all, y'all don't really know how dangerously brilliant I am, man. I'm telling y'all, I took a genius test, man. I did not miss that bitch. I just got bored. I'm telling you the truth. The girl's problem is no one has figured out how to creatively deliver their message from a woman's form, which makes the consumer draw to that story. The reason why girls, the reason why girls do not like draw out like that is because we know we're about to hear our story out their mouth and we don't believe that. How do you draw men to see the girls? Tell me your story. Tell us what it feels like to be you. How does it feel for you to prepare when your nigga is tripping? I ain't even heard no bars like that from no bitch. Like, writing raps while my nigga cheating on me. That shit, I don't feel that. So we're not even interested in hearing your story because your story is our story. And you're lying. That's why nobody draws to it. Because it's too hard. I never even heard, I I never not, heard it I'm broken down like that before. Did. I'm not, I'm not mad at it. Mad because think about it, right? Let's say it was a shorty that was mad nice. Because a lot of mm-hmm. the females are talented writers, right? But let's say they actually did that. We might be walking around like, yo, such and such. The They're the biggest in the game. world, bro. Right, right. Listen, listen, he might be because, right. He might but be see, right. listen, y'all. That's because people don't think. They follow. That's why it dies. The girls are not unique. They have to figure out to make us feel their pain. The same way we get on stage, we make people feel our pain. So can I ask one yeah. more question? Um, but but you know what, though, mm-hmm. Verb, though? Now, since I'm thinking about it, it would still have to be organic, though. We would still have to, no matter if you got that story, we would still, he would still have to deliver it in a way where we believe yeah, it. That's yeah, what yeah but, but see, but see. You know what I'm saying? Like, but, but, but guess what? It ain't the fact that we don't believe it. Just make us visualize it because we can't relate to them anyway in their life. That's true. You know, just make us understand what or per, pretend that what it possibly could feel like going. So, through. like, so, and then we go. Go ahead. 
No, go ahead, no go ahead, so like, all right, so like, all right, damn, like I'm from the trenches, I'm from the hood, or whatever the case may be, and you saying like the females are kind of too hard, and it's unbelievable because they telling y'all story. But like, let's say, like, let's say I really get into what I'm talking about, but I'm giving it to you from a female's perspective. You know what I mean? Like he said, organic. Like I've seen a lot. I've done a lot. Like I've been around a lot of things. Okay, okay, but look, but look, Zan, but look, Zan. Okay, you've seen and you've done a lot, right? Okay. Now, don't tell us from that side. Tell us from the uh, tell us the side of that story. From the tell us that side from the little girl who don't want to be here in this situation. Got you. The little girl, yeah, the, the little girl who's who's like, hey, listen, I do not even want to feel or be this aggressive. I want to feel like this, but I can't because Got of this. You. you see what I'm saying? That girl, we don't we, we don't want to hear because we know the stories. Like when girls talk that gangster shit on stage, it's a waste of time to us. Like especially if you come from where you're supposed to come from. It's like, I don't want to hear no bitch talking about that shit. Because for me, it's like, girl, go put a dick in your mouth. Like, I don't, I don't want to hear, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's like, no, what? Nah, bro. What? No, no, I'm serious. It's like, I, I, I need to, I need to feel you be something else. I, I like, give me another description because, okay, everybody that come from the hood story ain't the same. It's a, it, it's a nigga that plays ball in every hood. Who is turned out on the gang shit? He don't even want to be, but he got to. Then you got you got the little boy that's a rapper from the hood that the hood kind of just supports him. Everybody got a different story from the hood, man. But they they all intertwine. Mm -hmm. It's all the same rules. You ain't ducking that smoke from him, is you? You better get out there. Cause our mamas told us, hey, you better get out there. Fuck is you talking about? Get out there. So that's a that's a universal story. You got to get out there. Okay, we all know the little girl in the neighborhood that's walking through the, the little dirty little girl that everybody laugh at who grew up and become bad. Like, where is her story? Right. We don't hear her? Damn, like, so, okay, so we don't want to hear y'all get on stage and, oh, I'm going to do this. No, shut your bitch ass up and you don't know football players' names. <laughs> shut your fucking mouth. You know what I'm saying? That, because we, we know it's, uh, it's, like, it's like watching a, uh, it's like watching uh, a poodle bark. At a pit bull or something. It's like, shut up, man. Got you. Got you. Yeah. What you think? Uh, yeah, so. Fro wait, Frozen Live. What you think, A? I think majority of y'all is ass. You, you think majority of us no, is no, it, I, You ain't never like really no, like no, female. Yeah. Hey, e, I'm going to tell you something. Hey, e, I'm going to tell you something for real. Zan, Zan has a chance of being around longer the hotter you are. Because look, I'm telling you, for the consumer, appreciate it, man. But for the for the consumer um, who don't who don't know and don't live in Philly, y'all sound is so familiar it makes us listen to her. You see what I'm saying? Because the the regular person in the world they don't get to see Philly like that. So y'all sound rare like how we sounded rare. Okay, Philly ain't never really had nobody in the front at all times. Right. Okay, now we're hearing it. She sound like you. She's automatically half the halfway up the street. Automatically. Because now we getting a Philly thing, okay? This because because Philly never really had its full wave, but it's it's it's, it's a musical city, it's a rhythm based city. Mm -hmm. Like that's why Philly and St. Louis look even the same. It, like the vibe of it is close. You feel me? Those people supposed to be in the front. Now y'all in the front. The motherfuckers need to all rise and stand behind one. I I never understood why I stand against the hottest nigga. Like and I don't get into niggas wars, but this is my thing with it, right? How do you stand against the hottest? Yeah, nigga? that's crazy. <laughs> that don't make it's, sense. It's, that's just, but, but 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 I don't get in that shit because I ain't from they set. But for me, it's like okay, it's gonna happen to everybody when they when they power up in any regard. It's gonna happen. You're gonna be tried. You're gonna have to stand on it. Boom. That's what it's gonna be. You get through it. You you keep going. You fold. You don't. That's that's a part of it. But if we got a chance to be the number one of everything. Philly could be the number. Well, the number. Well, right now, St. Louis got the smoke right now, but Philly can be the number one. At any like, it just takes them to form one. Y'all got the powers, like the lineup of power out there. If it's you, if it's unified, it's dangerous. Mm -hmm. But you know what I'm saying. But it's like there. It'll take other people. Yeah, but, but 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 that city ain't never been a city to everybody come together though. Even from from you know from the state property days from the major mm -hmm. figure days and all of that days mm -hmm. like nobody really be sticking it. as you seeing right now nigga meat going through that shit right now uh -huh. i mean <laughs> like, but, like but what's y'all slogan right now 
said what? The brotherly love, right? I think that, because I'm yeah, trying to think yeah, that, that, that there was a joke, like a snake in the face. Like, they, they want yeah. to put oh, yeah, yeah, I, I think, think so, brotherly too. Love going on out there. Because soon as somebody I mean, I, I mean it, but every city going to have it. Every city going to have it. But the ones of y'all that do stand together can push it forward to the point where everybody going to get in line anyway. Like, it's it. y'all have the ability, the people that do the right thing and stay close to E, right? And they power that sound up. It will break the division because after a while, it's like you got to get in the car. Every 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 person that came out in St. Louis, I didn't know a lot of them. I wasn't cool with them niggas. But once but once the car keep moving and we see the same focus because we going this way, then everybody lock in after that. It's like oh, okay, we all understand each other now. You got y'all got that ability. Like all the good, the, the the best battles are coming from outside and being attached to battle rappers. I'll be throwing a card this this summer too in June, people. Ha <laughs> ha! Surprise, surprise. Yeah, all right. But uh, yeah, like because we see something that the the regular person don't see. We can look at rare and we can say he's like me. Get him on the court. Think about this. Who discovered Wayne and Nicki? A rapper. A rapper had to okay that. I'm I'm not Wayne. I'm sorry, Drake and Nicki. How did how did a nigga like Wayne have Drake and Nicki? How does Hov have Kanye and Rihanna and J. Cole? Like they see something else. They see shit. We see shit like because we know how how hard it is to put together something. We know that we know the stress it takes. Like a regular human don't know uh the stress in the mind that we have to go through to create this shit. So when we hear a nigga being great, we can hear little little lines of the uh, uh, of gravity defiance and be like, hey man. He really is 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 wilding because we know how hard this shit is. Like when we heard Loaded back in the day and we listening to him, we like the, the degree of difficulty is un, is unreal. Right. But when I heard a nigga go in little pockets and stay there for a second and it's all connecting, like not that one, two, three, four dumb shit. I'm talking about when I see him just acting up and his own methods. Oh, I'm like, let me hear it again. The whole jungle special, and then everybody in the jungle is kind of like you got squirrels, you got swamps, you got birds, pandas, you got these type of humans. Be your own. Okay, cool. If you view me as the old lion at the end of the street, okay, cool. You yeah, cool. the one that'll do anything to you in public and private, pussy. You know what's up with them, right? Okay, cool. We have to know those things instead of trying to make a bunch of everybody's trying to make themselves into some little monster that don't exist. Be the be the bitch ass animal that's put in your in your in your heart. If you are if you a soft ass parakeet, be a parakeet that barks that that tweets loud. Y'all niggas all want to be the same goddamn thing. That's why it's dying. But if the right niggas sit down, y'all done, man. And the culture will make millions. Matter of fact, I think we're going to push that through. We're going to push that idea through. Because at this point, it's like, okay, it's been ran many different ways, man. It's never been ran by people that can actually think. And and it got to be ran tight, like in a pyramid. Like, no, we don't put him on stage because of this. Why, Verb? Because I said, fuck him. Cool. I.e., why you don't want him on stage? Fuck that nigga. Fuck him then. Hit man. Oh, you know, I don't deal with All right, there it is. Dead. That's that's good for us. That's petty, but it's good. But we can eliminate behavior will change around this motherfucker. More respect will be displayed. More money will get generated. Come on, man. We, this, this ain't hard. More eyes because now we all promoting the same product. Come on, man. Like, this could work. This can fully work. And they only take four or five niggas. And Zan, don't get pregnant or nothing right now. Because, like, you got a wave coming. Oh, you know, I'm done and Zan, too. I'm when done you before... I'm a mother already. Okay. Yeah, okay, I'm good. So, and, and also, too, when you get your raps done, run them by each other. The devil is a lie. I can't hear nothing you saying.
Yeah, everybody, y'all know, man. I don't know what it is. Y'all already like. know. It's a bird of space right here, so it's probably about to be a dub in a couple of seconds. Do not be surprised if the dub was alive. The live just go. It's just a dub. It's just gonna go bad. Shout out to the trap as we are my back back lit. It's the out of here. Any man battle rap trap and we definitely got the streets. D out again, man. D out of here, man. Put it on your.